Here today we're going to be talking about the BKFC fight that's happening this weekend between Mike Perry and Julian Lane. This one is going to be a war. Both of them have animosity towards each other. They've been beefing at the press conferences. And if I'm being honest, it was looking pretty staged at that last press conference. Mike Perry pulled out a baseball bat. Like a detachable baseball bat that he could like take apart. It was... Just very odd overall. I was like, what the hell is going on here? This seems like a movie. It seems just super staged. But it was literally right after um, one of the people asked uh, Julian Lane if he brought a mouth guard to the previous fight that they had at a press conference. So it just seems like there's a lot of a lot of antics going on. That A lot of this is being staged. The fight's not going to be staged, though. I think that the BKFC organization thinks that they have to stage the animosity in the background. They knew that Julian Lane would be down to help start that and help uh, press Mike Perry at that press conference. But um, I don't think you guys are really here to hear about this right now. So um, let me get into the prediction. I am anticipating that Mike Perry wins the fight. It's going to be a lot of um, Julian Lane throwing that jab out. And he's going to be hitting Mike Perry a lot with it. But realistically, the one that's going to be able to survive the fight is Mike Perry. Mike Perry will let you break his nose. Mike Perry will let you bloody his face up. He does not care. But he's going to be able to set those shots up once he starts moving his head. Once he starts dipping under that jab and he starts, once he starts finding his rhythm, It's going to be a bad night for Julian Lane, but overall, it's going to be a good night for us because we get to watch this. We get to enjoy while they put it all on the line. It's going to be interesting to see, but overall, I am definitely anticipating that Mike Perry wins the fight by knockout, and I assume it's going to be in the late second round, maybe third round, but I'm not going to predict that one. I would definitely say Mike Perry wins by prediction. Uh by knockout though 100% because he definitely is going to be able to set his shot up a lot better if he's moving his head if he gets in there and he starts grooving he's really going to be able to connect on Julian Lane and we see what happens when people start connecting on Julian Lane it could be Julian Lane's fight the beginning of the fight it could be going his way the whole beginning but it usually doesn't go too well once they start connecting on him so We see what happens when Mike Perry connects. And once you put those equations together, you get Julian Lane going to sleep. So I'm definitely anticipating that, but you never know. So if you guys are putting your money on this, put it on Mike Perry. There's a lot better. I would say that the odds are probably in his favor, but don't bet on this. With that being said, I appreciate you watching this. Stay blessed.